Welcome. Today I'm going to show you one of the methods how you can use Google services on your Huawei P40 Pro. And it is not a click bite and the method works on the 100%. We are going to run a virtual machine on our phone and the method is not complicated. You just have to follow uh, every step. And uh, we are going to start by downloading virtual machine on our Huawei. So let's open our browser. I'm going to use the default browser from the Huawei. And right now we have to go I don't want to update right now, I'm going to do this later. We have to go for the search pool and type here famous.com. Click and enter. And here we are on the website of the virtual machine and we have to get this Famous Pro download. So let's click here. Let's stop one more time. Okay, right now it's, it's activated, so click download. As you can see at the first time it wasn't working but it now is cool and here we have during my time okay we have to wait a little bit so right now uh, you can just go for the website and just read all of the stuff that you have here all the instruction and I will be back after this uh, this file will be finished so just wait And as you can see the download is finished and right now we can start the installation process. So let's uh, click here on the switcher to accept and click allow. Okay, and as you can see it's full. It's, um, I mean, it's not uh, with the virus or something like that. Uh, so you don't have to worry about that. And by the way, I just forgot to tell you that this method is safe. We also tested it on the Huawei P40 Lite 5G and there are no problems with it. So, um, by the way, you have to let me know in the comment if you are satisfied with this method. But right now, let's go for install. And right now we can open it. Right now, just scroll down on the right side. And right now, tap on the Enter Famous Pro. Click one click authorization. Tap to set up now, tap on the switcher to draw over other apps, then just go back and accept all of the permissions by clicking on the allow. And we have to get this room, Android 7.1, so click to add. Okay, and right now we have to go for the settings, so tap right here. Click on the Google services on the switcher to activate, then tap on the confirm. Okay, it is complete, so click here. And after that, uh, we have to also scroll down and select the background cable live. Click allow. And after that, we have to reboot. So let's go for the shutdown. And right now, just open it one more time. And right now when we enter this, this menu, we'll be able to enter the Play Store. Right now we have to sync into our Google account. Okay, and let me just sync into my account, so I'm going to hide the password and email. Right now I just got it. And as you can see, we are... Oh, wait. Why just it lo log out me from the Google account? Okay, there's some kind of bug, so let's try to let's try to log in one more time. You have the same problem. Okay, and right now I'm gonna put the back phone and tap on the agree. Oh, I don't want to back up the Google Drive. Click accept. And as you can see, right now we can try download something from the Play Store. So um, if you try any other methods like uh, transfer with the phone clone from second phone 
or just uh, the petal search application, uh, you still cannot uh, use any of the apps, right? For example, Google Sheets or the Google Documents, you just cannot use it because you have to log into the Google account. So right now I'm going to show you that it is work here, it is working, so let's go for the Google Sheets for example. Click install. Let's open. And as you can see right now, it is working. So, um, you can also get any other apps because there is this Play Store like any or like on any other uh, Android device. So you have to hear every app, every game, wherever you want, you, you can get it on this uh, virtual machine. So right now, if you want to close it, you have to just click right here and you can just tap to minimize. And as you can see right now, we are back in our Huawei uh, stock launcher. And of course, if you want to back and use uh, some Google apps, you have to just click here and just make it bigger. Wait, wait, wait. Just double tap. And as you can see, here it is. So uh, I think it's really cool because you are able to use the Google, Google services on the Huawei smartphone. So tell me in the comment if yours is working and if you are satisfied with this method. Thank you guys for watching. Leave thumbs ups, comments and remember to subscribe to our channel. See ya!